What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, John, from the MD here. Welcome you back to another episode of this saga log. Hopefully, everything is going fine. Now, everything's going fine on my end. I accidentally opened it up on the pinwheel force, and that clip will be included right now because it was kind of funny. What's going on, everybody? It's John, from the MD here. Welcome you back to another episode of the saga log. Hopefully, y'all are having a wonderful, wonderful day. I am myself. I got to turn up the music a lot actually the music was actually very very quiet and so we had to turn it turn it down so or turn it up not turn it down you don't turn something up or down that's quiet anyway last episode we had a magical journey and uh, i'm at the dream yard oopsies i am way far away from where i need to go let me go ahead and cut um because yeah this is not where i'm supposed to be at all oopsies <laughs> <clears throat> Um, we're back. Okay. Yeah, that was really um, hilarious and uh, John being stupid. So we are at the Pinball Force having a great time. We trained our lovely team up to level 25 apiece, I believe. It might have been 24 apiece, but it's either that or... The... No, it's 25. Some 25s and some 24s. Good job, John. Um, I, my guess is these two were already there, um, but... Oh, I can see it right there. EXP. Yeah, okay, most of them were already there. I just was like, you know what? We're going to train them to 24, and if they get to 25, they get to 25. So, yeah, 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 so that's what happened. Okay, cool, cool, cool. So there was experience bars. Good to see those lovely experience bars. But, yeah, so training the team, uh, from what I remember, I believe... Actually, I should just go over the moves. I believe that some people learned a different move. I, I honestly don't remember. It was a couple days ago since I trained. We have... Force Palm Sludge... No, that's the same move set. Force Palm Sludge Wave. Poison Fang Toxic. Brittany's got the same move set. Tweedledee's got the same move set. Kaiba Boy's got the same move set. Okay, no. Nobody learned anything different. Okay. I'm just wrong and can't think a, think a thing. Okay, good to know. Um, I, my guess is that a lot of Pokemon had opportunities to learn something. And I just said no. Because why else would I remember them learning something and distinctly remember it? Like, it's not that I was like, oh, yeah, I think that this happened. Like, th th like I would have not shown the team if I knew that nothing happened. But, yeah, so the teams must have been, like, changed or something must have happened. But, yeah. So, today we have a kind of a scary episode as we have a gym battle that I'm not necessarily hyped for. Because it is our boy Berg. And Berg is known for being a Class A Nuzlocke killer, and yeah, we don't really need anything. Oh, pretty boat. Nope. Gotta go back. We gotta see a pretty boat. Hi. That's a sight I'm so used to seeing living where I do. Um, no, actually, when I go downtown, I see it, but it's like 40 minutes to go downtown, so no. I don't see it very often, but when I, it is a sight that I'm used to, because we actually have a lot of bridges in Washington. No, what? You mean that we have a lot of bridges where there's a lot of water? I know, it was a stupid comment, but it was a comment nonetheless. It was kind of, but yeah, no, honestly, it is kind of crazy, the bridges and how that all works. And, like, it's interesting to me, geology, not geology, geography. Geology is not what I was thinking of at all. Geology is the study, like, kind of like ancestry. But no, geography is interesting in how different places have different issues and problems that they have to, like, <laughs> think about and fix. Washington has flooding and, like, things like that. Uh, or, like, not really. You know, like, they get floods. They have problems. If there's snow, there's a big issue because nobody knows how to drive in it. But then you go to places like uh, central Washington where it's, like, pipes burst and pipes have issues everywhere like i know a couple people that have that issue and it's like i could not have frozen pipes no that is something i don't think i could live with in the conditions that i do not want to have met um no no thank you on that one um props to everybody who has to deal with the extreme cold temperatures because that is a no for me i like my 51 degrees in rain thank you very much um yeah, like, I don't care that it rains at all. Like, rain is the least of my issues. I have come to Castellia City to dance! Oh my gosh! Ugh. 
what are you gonna do? Just break dance and dance to some powerful music? Probably, honestly. Honestly, probably. I mean, oh, hi, that's another break dancer, dude. Where did I put those on? Oh, I found them. By the way, here, have Fury Attack. Another pointless TM. Thanks, I appreciate it. You definitely didn't make me feel that much happier. Woo! Also, yeah, like I said, we're fighting Berg, and Berg is actually over here, as you can see by the little gym icon telling you, by the way, the gym's over here, and to that I say, that's why I went that way. <laughs> Honestly, that is why I went that way. I did that just for the sake of things. Hey, codename, I just challenged the leader known as Berg. He, he, he kind of is your style, but, you know... He made me work for that gym badge, so it doesn't matter who or anybody is or who they want to be. But for me, that bug type trainer was a challenge. Oh, wait, it says that aren't much of a challenge. Bug types are a challenge. I'm going to keep winning like this against all of the unit of the leaders, because that's what you're supposed to do in this game. Then I will beat the Pokemon League and outperform the champion. If I do that, everyone will have to admit that I have the smarts. Yes, you do, Jonas. Um, I can admit that already. That will make me feel truly alive. Well, everybody in the comments, let Jonas know he's smart, because he is. Um, and hi, Berg. Aha! You are the one who fought Team Plasma in Pinwheel Forest. If I remember, your name is Codename? Come to my gym I and challenge my gym, I suppose. Uh, sorry, but I need you to wait a bit, because I was informed... Team Plasma has entered my whole amazing city. I was going to say horrible city. No, amazing city. In fact, come with me. I am going to knock on the... Or going to the dock at Prime Pier. Let's go to the Prime Pier, everyone. Uh, let's see the boats. Can we go whale watching? I would go whale watching. I want to see them orca whales. Orca whales were my... Are actually, funny enough, my one of my favorite whales. So, if you guys like orca whales... Definitely leave a like down below because I love my orca whales a lot. Like, I want to pet an orca whale. Actually, I feel like I... I didn't actually. No, I thought I did. I was like, wait, I pet an orca whale. What am I saying? I want to do something I've already done before. I mean, you can do things again. You you can you can always do things again. But, um, yeah, I actually had a stuffed animal back in the day named Shuka, who was an orca whale. Who I slept with like every day until I was like eight or nine, but it was in my room until I was like twelve, and then I gave it to my uncle or not my uncle, my uh, cousin. But yes, I did have an orca whale named Shuka. Crazy enough. Oh hi, Joy! I didn't even notice you were here. <laughs> I keep forgetting that Joy is like in the game. Like <coughs> Jonas <coughs> makes sense because Jonas is like main rival, and Joy is friend. But, like, also, they're both friends, so, like, it just make a difference. I spy a gym leader! <laughs> Last time went so well, I thought I'd grab another Pokemon. Rethinking that. I need to get out of here. Bye! Okay. Code! Oh my god, we gotta go. Uh, Iris, you stay with Joy. She's a wonderful lady who deserves your love and support. Yes, I agree. Joy deserves love and support. Go support Joy. Go support Joy. I'm gonna be Joy's bodyguard. So, after those... Go after those bad guys. Joy will be safe with me. Okay, that's all I care about. As long as Joy and Jonas are safe, that's what matters. Good, good. I agree. You keep Joy safe, and I go do whatever to keep Jonas safe, because I, I trust you. Definitely. I... Honestly, Joy can handle herself, but, you know, I always love when Joy has somebody by her side because it makes me feel even better and more secure. Um, hi, Team Plasma. See, I, I couldn't let anybody watch over Jonas. <laughs> Jonas would easily protect himself and not be let be being taken. Um, Like, somebody protecting him. He wouldn't let that happen. So, I'll let him protect himself. He's good at that. And, yeah. Anyways. Woo! I This has actually been a fun story. Not even gonna front. 
I've been loving this. I've been loving this Jonas myself because I've just named I, I named my character code name, but I literally am just myself in the game. Um, and then Jonas. It's actually been a fun dynamic to play around with. And trust me, I am getting things worked out so that Sogalock will have his own defined story next generation. Barring that we get there. So, we kind of have to get there really, really much. Um, because if we don't get there, then, uh-oh, what are we going to do? Now, unlike in so uh oh, no, 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 Dekon, you are not staying out on that. Absolutely no. Kaiba boy, get out here. Have a good time, Kaiba boy. Kaiba boy! Is any... Narcissus said any time Kaiba boy gets out there, I have to do that. So, uh, Naruto, you better be listening, paying attention. Because I'm doing and fulfilling your request. Um, but yes. Oh, you're role-playing! How nice. What would you... What would you LARP, Lugia? What would a Lugia LARP? Let me know what a Lugia would LARP. I am throwing comment questions of the day constantly. How, how fun is that? Um, yeah. What would a Lugia LARP? D Lugia would be so good at... Stop critting, Lugia. Lugia would be so good as... Oh, no, 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 no. What is his name? From the... Atreyu! Uh, that's what Lugia is cos gonna cosplay as. Lugia, Atreyu, or no, 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 no. Wait, no, 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 no. That's Falcor. I'm wrong. I am sorry. Anybody who's watched the Never Ending Story can now flame me for saying Atreyu and not Falcor. Okay, moving on. Um, <laughs> uh, I definitely... Uh, if people, if you have not watched The Never Ending Story, you need to. It's such a good movie. Um. No, 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 Iris. Iris. I said you bodyguard joy. This does not mean to bring joy into the danger. That is what me and Jonas are here to protect her from. Uh, we, I mean, joy, I mean, joy probably was like worried about us. To be fair, I would be worried too if I was just told that I got to sit there and not be part of any of this. Like, I, I agree. Like, I can see that. But, like, I, I Iris, you're not making me trust you at all. Thank you very much. Um. <laughs> uh, Iris, you, you, you don't want to do this. Because, you, well, you're, I don't even fight you in this game. That is so sad to think of, because in black, it's you fight Drayden, and in white, you fight Iris, I believe. So I don't even get my opportunity to, like, l destroy Iris for not listening to me. Ugh, poor, poor us, right? You know, can't actually do and forgive the character the consequences for their actions. Big sads. Um, but, you know, it is something. Statisticians only have one task. They conduct and request surveys. You, you wouldn't... What? I am so confused. I don't know what I'm supposed to do there. I'm. That's. I kind of shouldn't have. Like. I think. I think I have to talk to the peoples. Aw, you know who gives me joy? Joy and Jonas. I'm glad that you find people that give you joy, and I'm glad that I have my two people that give me joy. This is heart heartwarming and kind of hilarious. But. Hi, Team Plasma. Hi, Team Scary. My word. If it isn't the gym leader, Berg. So, uh, so what would you say? This is guiding principle of Team Plasma anyway. Oh my god, like, take what you want out from people. I don't even know who Bronius is. <laughs> I thought it would be amusing to prepare the hideout right in front of the Pokemon gym. 
but we were detected. Oh my god, that was more quick than I ever imagined. Indeed. No matter. We already have exceptional base operations. Is everyone familiar with the legend of founding the Unova region? I, I am! It's... Uh, what? Oh my god. The truth is, the Black Dragon appeared before a hero who sought the ideal way to knit together a world full of warring Pokemon and people. The Black Dragon-type Pokemon shared its knowledge and bared its fangs at those who stood against it. Together, the power of this Pokemon, the hero brought unity to the hearts of everyone in the land. And now, that is how Unova was created. We shall bring back the hero and that Pokemon to Yanova once again. If we win people's hearts and minds, we can easily create the world that I, I mean, Team Plasma desires. Here in Castelia, we have a lot of different kinds of people. Everyone's ways of thinking is vastly different from each other. Honestly, there's something about what you're saying that I don't quite understand. One thing that we all have in common is that we care a lot about Pokemon. Even people meeting for the first time, we can talk about said Pokemon. Talk about, talk, battle, or even a trade. Remember your speech at Accumula Town? You weren't even there for that! Were you? You were responsible for leading me to rethink my relationship with my Pokemon. For that, I thank you. At the time, I made a promise. I swore to myself that I would dedicate myself to Pokemon even more strongly. And what you are doing? Aren't you going to strengthen the bond between you and your Pokemon and Pokemon and people even more? Mwahahahaha. <laughs> you are quite hard to figure out. A little more intelligent than I've expected. I am fond of intelligent people. You will enjoy hearing about this. From every corner of the world, I've gathered knowledgeable people from our king's benefits. You could call them the Seven Sages. Very well. We will submit to your opinion and be on our own way. That girl over there, return her Pokemon. <gasps> Joy actually got the Muna! Wait, I forgot about that! <laughs> Joy, I might need to borrow that Muna. Just let, like, please. Tonight, especially, I might need to borrow that Muna. Uh, wow. Okay. That's amazing. I completely forgot that that was in the story. <laughs> Woo! Uh, Joy. I, I, I need to borrow the Muna, like, really badly. To be fair, if a Muna gives you Dream Mist, how long does the Dream Mist last? Also, that's a really good item. Does, what, do you think the Dream Mist would last a long time or a little bit of time? I think it would last a solid six hours. So not the full eight hours that you would need to sleep because what it would do is it would make sure you're asleep before exhausting the mist. And then it would do its thing. That is my opinion on the dream mist. I think that's what it would do. It's not be a for everything, but be enough of a thing. Also, was this like an area that I can go over? No, I can't. Oh, that's what it is. Also, I love how Berg's area, like, is literally all the clowns. Because I can see Berg just being, like, just a May fool. I need some inspiration for my art. I can literally see that coming out of Berg's mouth. Like, like let's be 100% here. If that isn't coming out of Berg's mouth, whose mouth is it coming out of? Like, in the Pokemon community, or in the Pokemon universe, Berg would be the one requesting for Jester's assistance. Also, that's the second straight psychic flying type we've run into. 
Yes! Uh, love it. Um, I'm gonna Smackdown, because I think a Smackdown will do a good amount of damage. I'm thinking it's gonna do like 75%. That kills! Never mind. I forget, my Pokemon are very attack centralized, so they can attack well, but they cannot defend well. That is the wrong one! No! Uh, I was super excited. I was like, yes, yes, yes! You're a fast Pokemon! You would love that move! No. Nope. That is not. Um, that is unfortunately not what we got. Ambipom. Helmet? Helmet. The thing is, right, is if Helmet doesn't kill it, it dies. That's, that's the one scary thing that we have in terms of with Helmet. Is Helmet will get murdered if Helmet does not actually do the murder ring um, itself. So, I definitely worry about the life that is of that. Um, yeah, let's not. How about no? Okay, well, Helmet killed it. Good job, Helmet. Good job, Helmet. We love you, buddy. We just worry about your life a lot because you have, you're frail. Um, but you have a high attack stat. Like, I really want to know what Helmet's attack stat actually is. Because I feel like it's massive. Like, is it is it in the high 100s, like 130? Because, it, I mean, it could also be that we have a positive nature. And that is influencing what I think. Hi, I knew that you were a trap. And I still walked on you anyway. Good job, me, I guess. Oh, it's a Wigglytuff. Hi. Hi, Wigglytuff. We're leading with Dakon. You are dead. You're a deadly tough. Tough luck, deadly tough. You have a lot of health. Wow. Um, We also are gaining so much experience from literally every source. It's hilarious. Slowbro. Hi, you are a potential problem, but I'm going to send in Troy. <laughs> Every time. Troy, get out here. And I'm going to say, I'm sorry. I'm, if you want me to not go Troy, you're going to have to kill Troy, okay? That's, that's just how it's going to work. Don't actually, because I'd be really sad. But Troy, you can kill it. Oh, you got a crit. Good job, Troy. Troy, Mr. Crit Master, how are you doing? Also, this is, like, honestly, I am excited to see what you guys kill. This is episode 128. So, in, in two episodes, y'all are killing something. That is a morning sun. I don't appreciate that slow, bro. That, that literally forces me to have to get a crit. Come on, Troy. Get the crit. Thank you, Troy. Thank you. Also, us healing didn't help Troy. I need a toxic orb. Oh, heal bell. No. Troy literally is the exact opposite of a Pokemon that needs that. No. Uh, Troy, you have toxic heal. You want to be poisoned. No. Not allowed. Beep. Beep. But yeah, no, honestly, it's this has been crazy. It's been crazy in and of itself. Just all of the, like, insane things that have just constantly been a thing. Also, we have potions that we can utilize to keep ourselves fully healed and hydrated for the next battles ahead. Um... Is Brittany only level 25? I think that's what I saw. And if that is the case, it is the case. I am going to switch into Brittany. I want to have a few level 26, uh, 26s before heading into the gym. Because the ace of this gym is level 27. So we want to make sure that we are apt to handle that. And honestly, you guys might actually get to see that next episode. Because we're probably too far in. No, we're not. Okay, this it will be this episode. Cool! Never mind, you will get to see it. 
It's just I have one more trainer left, and then... What? Oh, they were both already pressed. Ugh. I fought both of the optional trainers. John. Why? I'm not... Uh, that, that was really... That was two massive oops that I made. That's all I gotta say. That was two, not not one massive oof. That was two. Also, we were faster somehow, so we're we're killing it now. But how in the how in the world did I make two massive oops like that? Just it's hilarious. I mean, to be fair, that's how this gym is supposed to trick you. But also, uh, unless I am not being tricked by it, but I think I am. I think that was lit up before. And I just straight up fell for it twice. Yeah, no, it literally was. Good job. So then that is definitely a good job, John, moment. We got plenty of those all the time if you're on the channel long enough, so... Oh, my God. Okay, so I'm nerve-wracked. That is a good reason to be nerve-wracked. Hi, Hydragon. Hi, Pokemon. I definitely... Actually... Well, I say I don't want to fight it, but also, I kind of... That's fine. I'm going to go on the side of that's fine and send in Dacon. Because I trust Dacon. I need to know... I need to know who's faster between Dacon and Helmet. Because... Once I figure that out, that'll be some fun. That, that, that's a crit. That is the we don't do that. That is the no no. Dual Chop has a good chance of missing, so. Again, our, we, I, we know that our fighting types are frail. Um, the other thing we know is that Helmet actually takes things better physically rather than specially. Oh, no. Okay. High Dragon's gonna be an issue. I, I, I see this being really bad. Okay. 38 speed in comparison to... 47. You've revealed two fighting moves. But also Dark Void's gonna be an issue. Or no, you've revealed Dual Chop and Dark Void, actually. That's a... I'm still gonna send in, because that's a physical move and a sleeping move. So, it still makes sense for me to send in Helmet. Because Helmet should tank this much better. Helmet is not faster. That did 30 damage. Let's slow you down. So, if Helmet hits... Please. 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 No, Helmet! Uh, Helmet! Uh, why did I know you were about to do this? Why did I know that you were about to hit yourself... In confusion. Helmet. Oh, Snatch. So you have Flatter, Snatch, Dark Void, and Dual Chop. So Dual Chop is the only thing you can hit us with. Cool. So this fight's much more of a... This fight is much more of a wait for things to happen. Because Snatch is actually a great move. It actually takes, if you, if let's say that I use sword stance, instead of me getting the sword stance, they would get the sword stance, is how that works. So yeah, it's kind of a scary move and not a move I definitely want to be touching. So I'm gonna try and avoid touching the move. I think that's a good idea. Helmet's level 25, what's the line? Brick break. I am definitely teaching brick break. 
75 and over 100. I like Low Sweep having a 100% chance. So I'm going to go ahead and get rid of Force Palm. Because it has, with a potential of Paralysis, I'd rather 100% lower it down by 1. Rather than having a 30% chance to lower by 2. That is a pretty ducklet, I know. Um, Kaiba Boy, deal with that please and thank you. And you guys are not actually going to be seeing this gem. Because that is going to actually have to be saved for the next episode. I hope you all had a wonderful, wonderful day. And we will see you guys next time. Bye.